perhaps uh, four points, right? Just to, to conclude. The first one is that elimination of the gender-based violence is the human rights issue. As long as we have uh, the violence against women and girls in any given society, inclusive Montenegro, there is no full implementation and respect for the human rights in that society. Second point is that language which we use, not only in the content but also in the form, does matter. It matter not, matters not only in the media, it matters in our day-to-day -day conduct, be it personal, within the family, or be it in the public places and spaces, regardless of the function, the role, the job that we have in our everyday life. Third point, perhaps to, to add, uh, I very much uh, appreciate the call for the action from all and prevention. As I said initially, I believe, and there is an evidence, that femicide is preventable and that every single death could have been prevented had there been actions in place before. So I would like to call upon all not to wait for these incidents to happen, but indeed apply risk-informed preventive action before we have yet another death, yet another case of the violence in the society. And last but not least, I would like to call upon the representative of government, of parliament, of all institutions, of all of us in going into 2022 to make the elimination of the violence of, on women and girls the top priority and to show that in actions, in financing and in taking the concrete steps to prevent any single case in Montenegro. Thank you.